Praise the Lord, everyone! Today, we are going to make Noah's Ark and a rainbow. But before we start our arts and crafts, let's say our Bible verse for today. It's from the book of Numbers, chapter 10, verse 29. So let's say that together. The Lord has promised good things. The Lord has promised good things. Amen. Making Noah's Ark, we need scissor, we need a glue, we need marker, it's color brown, or you can use crayon, it's also brown. You can use any color what you prefer, a paper plate, like kind of animals, two by two, it's two of a kind. Okay. You can draw and you can color and cut it and you can stick it in Noah's Ark, okay? So this is what we need for making Noah's Ark. For making a rainbow, we need crayons or you can use a marker and we also need colored strips like a rainbow color. In case you don't have like a colored paper, you can use the white paper and color this white paper, make a rainbow color. You can cut it out and it turns like this, a glue, scissor and white paper. That's what we need for making a rainbow. So, so, there were a bunch of people, I mean like a lot of people, a long time ago that were not listening and were not obeying God. And, and they were making bad choices. And God did not like that. But there was one man and his family that were making good choices. And do you know what his name? Yes, Noah is his name. And he was making very good choices. And Noah loved God and God loved Noah. And so, God told Noah, I would like you to build an ark. I would like you to build a big boat that has enough room for your family, that has enough room for two of every kind of animals. So, Noah started to build an ark, a big boat with his family. And he hammered and he sewed and he put nails in and he got it all built up all nice and ready for all the animals to have inside so Noah says come on inside everyone my whole family and all the animals too of every kind all the animals and Noah and all his family got inside the big ark and then do you know what happened it started to rain and 40 days and 40 nights they were there for a long long time but noah and his family they obeyed they listened to god they were all in there after a while, but they were been there for so long. And do you know what happened? God sent a rainbow. Yes, a rainbow. And a rainbow that was in the sky. And God promised with this rainbow that He will never flood the earth again never as uh, so what he said as what God says in um, in Genesis chapter 9 verse 15 it says there 
I will remember my covenant between me and you and all living creatures of every kind. Never again will the waters became flood to destroy all life. And so Noah and his family, they were on a dry land. It wasn't raining anymore. They had a beautiful rainbow to remind them of God's love for everyone. So Noah and his family were very happy. So when you see a rainbow, always think, think of God's love for you and remember that there were always a rainbow at the end of the rain. On the top of these clouds, you can write down our Bible verse. The Lord has promised good things. And it's going to be like this. The Lord has promised good things. Okay, so here you go. Here is the rainbow promise and here is Noah's Ark. Good job, children. So, do you remember our Bible verse from the book of Numbers, chapter 10, verse 29? The Lord has promised good things. The Lord has promised good things. Yay! Good job! So when you see a rainbow, think of God's love for you. And remember that there were always a rainbow at the end of the rain. Thank you everyone! God bless you! Bye children! See you soon!